What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Sword walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we actually went through our very first battle here in the Pokemon League Challenge, Pokemon Gym Leader Challenge, and all that stuff. And yeah, found a few things, talked about a few things, got sidetracked a lot. Yeah, kind of did that. Anywho, in this episode, we're going to be facing off, I guess, another trainer. I don't know who, who the trainer might be. But, I did do a little something right here. Now, I did remember that we have a move rememberer as, mo as well as a move forget- You know, guy, jack of all trades guy. And, yes, I did teach our good old friend right here, Dra uh, Dreepzilla's two new moves, Dragon Dance and Phantom Force. He just had to remember it. That's right. So now we're ready to take on the next trainer right here. And, well, we're going to be going straight to Dreepzilla first because, well, you know... Jeeps that needs the attacks and all that stuff. So let's go right ahead and face off onto our next opponent. And, uh, well, as always, we're going to be dominating. I wonder who the next trainer might be. And, uh, yes, it's Hop. So it is time to mop the floor with this little snot nosed kid. I don't even want to shake his hand. I just had this sort of flashback, you know. Remember back when we were still at Postwick? When we got our Pokemon from Lee that day, I never would have dreamed that I would end up standing here, facing you of all people. But it's time. I finished what we just what, what was started that day. Got it? The one who will become a champion is me. Throwing a big old middle finger right at your face. Okay. I am going to literally mop the floor with this kid. I am going to destroy him. <laughs> okay, so here we are taking on Hop, and well, he thinks he's gonna beat us. Here he comes out with a double. Okay. <laughs> oh man, I am going to mop the floor with you. Okay, I'm really fired up for this match at the stadium. Okay, I see how it is. Alright, let's go. Let's go, Dragon Dance. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, we're gonna we're gonna definitely destroy this guy right here, and he's gonna be coming out with a Zen headbutt. And that is not effective, but look at this. We gave ourselves a little leftover. That way we can actually prepare for this whole uh, ass kicking with a lifetime. So what's going to happen is I'm gonna actually use Dragon Dance quite a few times before this guy hits us, and he's going to be going with a Cotton Guard. He's going to try and be all strategic with us. This is a, yeah, his, his, a, his, a, his defense is a going up drastically, yes. Uh, Double is a very, very, very wooly Pokemon, very beefy Pokemon, so we're going to be going with quite a few Dragon Dances right here. Look at that. And here comes another Zen Headbutt. Not effective. Because look at that. <laughs> oh, we are going to mop the floor with you. We are going to destroy you. I am going to have my way with you right now. And well, that is four. And here comes a cotton guard. Okay. Maximum effort. Let's go right ahead. And let's go ahead and heal. Let's heal up. He's just looking at me. He's like, this is a new strategy that you've done before. Yep. Let's see. Let's go with Psychic Fangs. Psychic Fangs is a physical attack, and that right there will hit it pretty hard. And crap baskets on a crapsicle stick. Okay, so you have uh, avoided that that uh, that thing right there. So there we go. Using the leftovers. Let's go straight for a Dragon Pulse. Okay, Dragon Pulse. Get a little boost because it's the same tech, same typing. And there we go. Here comes another. Another Zen headbutt still won't work. And uh, yes. And you can see its tail just like, you know, changing colors and all that stuff. So here we go. Again, Dragon Pulse for the win. Bam. And just like that, Double has been defeated. Whew. Okay, alrighty. Let's heal up yet again. I think we just picked up a darn good strategic. And no, I'm not switching Pokemon. This guy is literally coming out with some Pokemon right here that like are bulky and stuff. Okay, Dragon Pulse for the win. 
Now that we are extremely strong. There we go. And that right there. Oh, wow. Okay. So heavy slam will hit us. Oh, crap baskets. Okay. So that is a pretty, pretty hefty attack right there. Okay. Let's see. Let's go straight for Dragon Fangs right here. Or not Dragon Fangs, but Psychic Fangs. And there we go. Since it's a physical attack. <laughs> What now? What now? What now, Hop? We're gonna beat you with just one Pokemon. Okay, he's gonna come out with a Corviknight. Okay, this might be a little bit of an issue. This might be a little issue. But, I think it can be done. Dragon Force, or Phantom Force. Okay, alrighty. And the scary face it will not work on us. And yes, we will heal up our Pokemon. And Dreepzilla. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my god. Woo, man. I am enjoying this. I am enjoying this a lot. Oh my god. Woo. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, Hop is just getting so frustrating. He's coming out with a pink crinching. Okay. Wow, this Pokemon right here, this electric type Pokemon. Okay. Maximum effort, Phantom Force. We are faster than him. He won't hit us. And here comes a curse attack. And, uh, huh. It is lowering its speed and increasing it, both its defenses. Or, you know, it's attack and defense. So here we go. Phantom Force. For the win. There you go. <laughs> Hop's just wondering, what the heck is going on? Why can't I touch him? Yep, and there we go. We get healed yet again. Who said good old Draven doesn't do strategy? Who says that now? And, well, he's like, you got to be back into a corner. <laughs> Make your victory all better. Okay, whatever you say. So here he's coming out with a Rillaboom. And... I know he's going to Dynamax his Pokemon, so we're just going to release all the thoughts. Pure boarding to the wishing star. Time for a Dynamax. You know he's angry. You know he's angry. And he is throwing that Pokeball. And, well, you know me. I am not going to Dynamax because I am going to prove this kid. I'm just going to prove him wrong. I'm just going to prove him that, like, hey, man, you can't touch me. Can't touch this. And we are faster than you, by the way. So, yes, Phantom Force. So we vanish. And whatever move you try is not going to hit us right here. So here comes a Max Darkness. That would have actually hurt us. So here we go. Phantom Force. Hits him. Nearly beats Rillaboom. Okay. And the Max Darkness. Hits us. Oh, wow. Okay. How's that? Learned a lot by studying all these old matches. It's one hit. It's only one hit, and uh, as far as I'm concerned, I'm going to do it again. Oh, yeah, he's going to heal up his Pokemon. Okay, I see how it is. This is what happens when good old Draven starts talking a lot of BS, so let's go right ahead. I think he's already at, like, at second turn, right? Oh, nope, third turn. Hey, <laughs> look at that. Okay. Phantom Force. For the win, throwing the middle finger at you. I am throwing the middle finger at you up. I embarrassed you. Who's your daddy? Yes, that's me. And somebody's learning Body Slam. And that is Michelangelo. Oh my god, this is a good move right here. Hmm. Screw it, let's go. Let's switch it out for Rock Tomb. And we'll eventually learn like Earthquake somewhere down the line. And yes, our Pokemon are growing levels. Hop is like, what? <laughs> Throwing both middle fingers at you, kid. Throwing both middle fingers. He's like, Draven, thanks, man. I'm really glad you were the one here with me. <laughs> I'm throwing that middle finger at you. Throwing the middle finger at you. And I'm just going to put it right here. Hop domination. Domination. <laughs> And the victor of the semifinals, the challenger who has won their way all the way through many hopeful trainers in the gym challenge is Challenger Draven. 
Suck it, Hop. Okay, so Hop right here is like, you know, even when Sonya was saying that you and me look like uh, we could become heroes, I really never felt like one. You're not. But you, mate, I think you maybe, uh, you, you really could do all sorts of great things. Just did. Kicked your butt with one Pokemon. Good on you, Draven, and Drokaloke, and all the rest of your team. Mm hmm Okay. Well, that was another episode of Draven being cocky. And after that battle, everybody's like, oh, wow. Seriously, you're posing? You're posing? Oh, my God. I hate these guys. Okay. So here's Leon. He's like, Draven, that was incredible. Brilliant. Honestly, there were even tears rolling down my face before I even knew it. To think the two of you set out together from the same town, built up the greatest teams, and arrived here at this point to throw everything in you had one at one another. That burning desire to win, those moves filled with undefeatable passion. It was battling at its very purest in every possible way. Even though there were some trainers who weren't sure about whether you uh, you were fit to be endorsed for the gym challenge uh, first. That was you, Lee. Well then, all the more reason. My team members and I will give you everything that we've got us to defeat our challenger. And the challenger standing before us might well might as well be end up being you, Draven. In fact, that's precisely what I'm hoping for. Okay. That's right, Draven. The real challenge is what's coming next. And I'm completely exhausted. I just want to head back to the hotel and rest. Best refill your energy stores first. Why don't we uh, go get some dinner together? I wouldn't say so. I wouldn't say no, but... You never care all, uh, at all about the food taste like, Flea. A night like this is more like ru more than rubbish takeaway, so at least pick something good. Wow. Leon or Lee, how are you uh, how are you brothers with this kid? Seriously. How do you how do you take this guy? So look at that. After eating some rubbish, we are in the hotel all healthy and ready to go. Yeah, okay, alrighty. And yes, the news is coming for me, but guess what? We've got some questions. First question. You and Challenger Harp were both endorsed by the champion, making the two of you rivals in a sense, wouldn't you say? Nope, he's not my rival. He's just an underling. How does it feel to be def or de to have defeated your rival? I'm just going to look at him and be like this. He was no challenge. He is not my rival. Seriously, why are you even here? Anywho, uh, let's see. It doesn't feel real yet. I'm glad I could beat him. It was just luck that... Nah, no, no, no. I'm glad that I could beat him. <laughs> right. Question number two. If you wanted to tell your Challenger Hub something right now, what would it be? Fuck off. That's all I could say, guys. I'm sorry for cussing, but that's how, that's what exactly what I would say. Uh, let's see. I thank him for a great match. I tell him how strong he was. That he would be the rival I knew he was. Yeah, I'm just posting that because... <laughs> <He's>, <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like they're forcing you to make to say nice things to this kid. Question three: Level with me, kiddo. Your honest thoughts here. Think uh, you can uh, win the finals too? Yes. Yes, absolutely. All right, that's enough. Draven started from battle. You've uh, been asking rather rude questions. No, they've been asking some good questions. Leave them alone, Hop. We got ourselves dinner plans with my brother. So sorry, but clear off already, would you? Yes, yes, I understand. Looking forward to seeing uh, the birth of a new star. Give me a new champion, you know. <laughs> Whew, famous people sure have have it rough, eh? I hope Lee gets here soon. I could eat my own arm about it now. Okay, alrighty, so we're not gonna go there. <laughs> Several hours later. This is absurd. Even Lee's never did this late. Something not something's not right. He always does what he says he'll do. As a kid, he promised he'd become champion one day, and we went and just did, did just that. He ought to be able to keep his own uh, like dinner plans. And, well, Pierce is like, kid sure's got a mouth on him, huh? Yeah. If you were that noisy during your battle, you'd unleash a whole new level of power, or no, level of power, you know. That is true, man. <laughs> that is so true. Oh, pack it in, Piers. I'm seriously worried here. So I don't need to see your smug, uh, smug mug looking like you uh, having a go at me, even though you act like you're giving me good advice. No, he's just telling the truth. Seriously. Judging my appearances, no wonder you lost to your mate. <laughs> oh, man. 
Oh man, if you're looking for a champion, I saw him heading to the Rose Tower. Rose Tower? Why would he go there? Don't know what I don't know what he's up to, but I ran into him at the Monroe platform. He said he'd tell you uh, that he uh, he had something to do at the Rose Tower, so he'd be late to your dinner. But why Rose Tower? What could he have to What could he have to do there at this hour? Hmm. Pierce, do us a favor. Take us to Rose Tower, would you? Neither Draven nor I uh, know the way. I actually know the way. <laughs> Sheesh. What rude siblings? Always so demanding of others. Though, I suppose, it's a real problem for me, too, if the finals are held up for any reason. And I don't really hate the two of you little runts. You were good enough to beat me, after all. So I think I'll invite Team Yell along, and we'll all have ourselves a bit of fun, shall we? Brilliant! You're the best peers. Let's go make some... Make, let's go make a real ruckus. Okay. Alrighty, so yeah, the next adventure we have to go to the Rose Tower because something's happening, something's going on, and uh, kind of need to get this thing going because uh, yeah, good old Draven needs to win. He needs to win another gym, like another Pokemon League championship and all that stuff. So, thank you guys again for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, including uh, the whole you know, you know, uh, trashing, you know, gassing on uh, on uh, on Hop and all that crud. If you guys want to make a small donation to the channel. The heart is right there, and uh, the link is in the description below. I will see you guys in the next episode as we do something else, I guess. See you guys.